I just found out That's there's rear end grease. Oh no. Rear All the way down the right lane. So folks, go ahead and loosen your belts. We are going to be down just a couple of minutes while we clean up that rear end grease rear from end that truck. Grease. But All the way down the That'll give me plenty of time to talk about these motorcycles. Maybe I like the left side now. That'll be about an hour cleanup. Day two, recommend race week. We're about to make. Well, we're not about you to. You know, do just in case now. something happens, <laughs> we do need you guys. Maybe at some point we'll do track. something. If you break, pull off the track. Don't just drag that grease all the way down. Or again, oil, while we've got a little bit of downtime, right side of the track. The same exact stuff. Potter in the left lane. Day two, let's go make our first rip. Let's make this one and done, baby. Eleven thirty. Daddy's going to race. Avila. All right, guys, here we go. First pass. We got, huh? So I drove out of the groove and got squirrely. So that sucks. Scoreboard says 1302. 940 at 147, still letting out. That was our one of our best short tracks. It was a 6005. Man, that would have been our personal best right there. We're gonna we're gonna try to do a little bit more. Second qualifier, we are I think officially fifth place. There's some fast guys in front of us. There's four of them that are going now. Guido, and then there's this, this hot rod. Man, this guy is fast. 860s. He's bad to the bone. We're going to go do our thing. We're going to stay in the groove. We're going to leave a little harder. Personal best time, baby. Burnout time. Second pass. So I'm editing this video and I'm realizing that I didn't really do much more on this day. <clears throat> you can tell my voice is still shot from Rocky Mountain Race Week, but um, we launched the car really hard, blew the boost pipe off here, and then noticed that we had some cracking in the in the trans tunnel. The picture is going to see like the torque boxes are fine. I've got on the car like they're not ripped. We've got uh, torque box reinforcements. We've got all kinds of good stuff in the torque boxes, but the actual uh, trans tunnel itself was cracking. It basically like the car was like folding like a taco. Like it wasn't pretzeling side to side. It was like the back half of the car behind the bar and then in front of the main hoop were like separate. They were going like this. So I took the car to Hayden Wilson's shop, Meticulous, and man, he hooked us up good. Thanks again, Hayden. I appreciate it. Look at all that bracing we added. We, I say we. I, I didn't do shit. Look <laughs> at <laughs> Dang. Yeah, I tried to put them where all the bolts kind of were like in the center of the bolt pattern. So yeah. Them torque box is going to be supported now. Hopefully, hopefully it does something. I used to <laughs> right yeah, we're gonna, I'm going to find out off the rip today. Yeah. Bandimir usually sticks really good. I'm going to freaking hit it hard. Yep. Man, that looks like it was meant to be there. That looks so good. Yeah. I'm excited to see what it does for you. Well, yeah, so there's there's what we don't want any more of. <laughs> Jeez.
from this point we picked the car up from Hayden and we still had uh, some drive to go. So we had to do our mountain drive to Bandemir. So we had like three or four hours to go. Uh, so that was kind of what this is. So we picked the car from Hayden uh, and then we proceeded to make our way the rest of the way uh, back to Wiley Roots, down the, the route to the checkpoints and then to Bandemir. So that's pretty much all the racing action that we had for that day. I'm going to put the next racing on the next day <laughs> and you guys are going to see the rest of that. But uh, drive fast, take chances. Day three, day three of racing coming soon.